hello everyone uh, so in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create highlight covers okay in the last two videos I explained to you the importance of having highlights on your Instagram okay I cannot even overemphasize on the importance of highlights on your Instagram everyone should have highlights on their Instagram okay is the easiest and the quickest way people new uh, new page visitors can get the idea of what you do uh, the services you offer if they can trust you and everything okay within a short period of time without going through the struggle of going to your page and other things okay so now in this video i'm going to be showing you how to create highlight covers okay it will make your page look more professional and attractive okay so the first thing that you need to do we need a software to design our highlight covers okay um go to www um sorry www.canva um, go to www.canva.com um, 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 um. okay so um so once you type www.canva.com so if you have never used canva before it will take you to a page where you can then sign up okay you can sign up with your email address or your or your or your facebook account okay? so um the next step is to design our highlight covers okay so the first thing that we need to do is we need to choose a dimension okay? so um uh, there is already there is already um a dimension for instagram highlight covers okay you can go to recommend it. then search for instagram story highlight cover. there are already existing uh, highlight covers that are already made by already existing templates okay that are already made by uh canva okay so you can look through the template and see if you see anyone that if you see any of the template that suits your brand you can go ahead and choose it but for the sake of this tutorial i'm going to design highlights from the beginning okay so the first thing that you need to do uh, is let's say to, so so the initial color is white okay so then you can use your brand colors okay to design your so let's say in this example let's say uh, i want to use red and white okay i want to use red color and white color let's say my brand colors are red and white okay so the first thing that you need to do is click on this white click on the, click on here the color let's change the background color to red okay so since my brand colors are white and red if your brand colors is yellow and green orange and white then you can go ahead and use it okay so the next step is to um so our brand colors are red and white so now our background is already red so let's let's go to LA. Okay. click on element let's search for let's search for cycle so this is what a lot of people uh, pay graphic designers or social media managers to do for them they charge at least three thousand for highlight covers and even so so you can use this thing to make money too you can offer you can be opening these services to other businesses so let's search for cycle click on cycle okay so uh, let's swipe so there are a lot of different shapes of cycle that you can use okay so just go through the circle and look for the one you want so um let's look through the cycles so there's a one cycle with um so the thing about Canva is that there is pre version and also there is uh there is the paid version there is pro one okay so if you want to use this one you will have to pay but since i am already in the paid version i can use this i can use this pro one okay the premium icons but for the sake of this tutorial yeah you can use this one is also pro so let me look for the one i want and then i can use it can use it let's let me just choose this one okay um let me just choose this one let me just choose this one okay 
so once you you selected this one just click on it it will show here so then you can decide you can drag it and resize it then you can take it take it to the middle okay um i think this one is kind of big so let's just make sure that it's centered okay make sure that is centered let's add a little bit okay so the next step is to um so you can go ahead and add, add your icon but i want to add i want to spice it up a little bit okay let's search for another cycle uh, yeah let's do this one just tap on it okay let's change the color this is another cycle so this one also so so so, so. yeah let's use this one Let's let's add the size of this. Okay. Okay. So, ooh, wow. So the next step is to choose the icon that represent the highlight you want to create. Okay. I told you that you can create highlight for about us, testimonials, your product picture, let's say shoes, bags, uh, home decor, just search for, uh, what you need to do is go to elements. Okay. Element again, then type the words you are looking for the, the icon for. Okay. So let's say I'm, I'm going to design an uh, highlight covers for about us. So what I need to do is search for, uh, about us okay about us then click on enter then you can see different icons that you can use as about us okay let's just use this one so this one is pro version okay but i already told you that i am using pro the pro version so uh, did i use two so But there are a lot of um, free ones that you can use, okay? There are a lot of free, free, free ones that you can use, okay? So, see? So, that's it. Uh, let, let's say this, okay? So, that's it. Now, you have put, you have created highlight for About Us. Next is to create highlight for... Then you can save it, okay? Or you can just copy it, okay? You can duplicate it. Then delete it, okay? Then you can create highlight for testimonials 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 okay so then you you see different icons that you can use for testimonials okay we can use um let's use this one okay you see you can use this one okay you can also change the the icon color you can click here well once you tap on the icon then click here okay you can decide which color let's say it's red since our brand color is red you can turn it into red so let's say this one also since our colors are red and white let's say this one we want to turn it to red also so you see these are our highlights highlight covers you see isn't this beautiful then the next step is to um yeah you can also create let's create another highlights okay just search for um what else what else what else uh let's say for price list okay you want to create highlights for price list so that when people come to your page they can just go to your highlight to your price list and see if they can afford your product or not you see you can use different icons for your price list you can use this one Okay, you can use this one change the color to red so once you are done you can go ahead and uh, and save it you can click here come to download okay click on download make sure it's in the file type is png size normal then click on download okay it will download to your 
um, to your to your design. Uh, so let me show you another way that you can get um, that you can get icons. Okay, uh, free icons. So if if you don't want to use the pre in the paid version, okay, you can go to uh, a website that's called Icon Pinder. Icon Pinder. So once you search for Icon Pinder, you see it. Click on Icon Pinder. You can get different any kind of icon that you want in the world you can get it here okay just just put the word let's say maybe food you want to you see you can see different icon that you can use okay but but they are telling you that you'll have to pay for the icons okay you'll have to pay for the icons let's say i want to use this one okay um then i will just do right click okay i'll just do right click then save save as yeah save as let's say save as i'll just save it to my to my computer okay then come back to canva okay uh, first let's go to um let's go to downloads okay let's come to downloads um um food right let's search for food and that watches food where is the picture where is the, this is the icon right just just copy it okay let's go to canva and paste it so you see so these are all my picture this is the picture i use for this um uh, training i got it from yeah i got it um yeah from okay. so the next step is to let's say let's say so since you got your your icon from icon finder you just come to instagram Come to Instagram, okay. This one, okay. Mm. Let's use. Oh, yeah. So just tap on the icon that you just imported, okay. Click on it, okay. You see. So this is how all these uh, graphic designers, these social media managers, okay, are using uh to collect your money so this is how you can design your highlight covers once you download them you can send it to your phone if you use a computer you can also use the canva application on your phone to design your highlight but it's more difficult then after that you just save it and then upload it into your highlights okay um okay so now let me show you how you can install the highlight covers on your instagram page uh, i'm going to be using my phone now okay so let me show you how you can install your um highlight covers in your on your instagram okay so let's let's assume that you have already created your highlight right so what you need to do is come to the highlight that you want to install the right highlight covers to it just click on it tap on it and hold okay tap and hold okay then you'll see this option shows up click on edit highlight okay and then click on edit cover click on edit cover uh, like I said like I said in the videos okay you cannot create highlights um, you cannot add pictures to your highlight from your uh, sorry you cannot add pictures to your highlight from your gallery okay if you want to add pictures to your gal to your highlight you first have to put it on your Instagram story then add it to your highlights okay so let's click on edit cover um, after you click on edit cover click on picture okay then you will see uh, I've already sent this highlight to from my computer to my phone okay so let's select let's say we want to create highlight for about us okay so let's select a highlight for about us then let's make sure that it's centered let's make sure it's centered okay yeah then click on done so once you click on done so it will show like this so that's how you you click on the other one click on the second one click and hold then click on edit and then you can follow the same process then let's use this one let's make sure it's centered 
then click on done after that um, click on done so this is how you can um, so this is how you can install your highlight covers okay that's it didn't you, didn't you see that our page is starting to look like uh, look attractive now we have come to the end of the first stage of instagram marketing which is clarification i showed you how to find your target audience people that need your product how to know the solution and benefit of your the product your customers get when they buy your product i also showed you how to do your branding also how to optimize your instagram page how to set up your account for success the right way i also showed you how to make your page look attractive by creating highlight covers um so that's it about the first stage of instagram marketing the second stage is about attraction now since you know who are who are the people that need your product okay so the next step is to develop strategies that will attract these people to your page okay that will make them become your followers and customers how you can do that is that by developing the right content okay advertising different kind of organic strategies okay so in this stage i'm going to be sh I'm showing you how to create content that combat the cells okay i'm going to be sharing with you a script that um um social medias managers use okay to collect money for to collect fifty thousand for a month job and do the all the work under three hours how to how they can how the social medias managers create 30 days content under three hours i'm going to be showing you how to how you can also do that how you can create content 30 days content under one hour and how you can automate it how you can make the post uh, to be posting how you can automate the post okay even if you are not online the post will go on okay and other things so see you in the next module